Hospital records show that patients suffering from a specific disease die 60% of the time. What is the probability that of five patients suffering from this disease, three will survive? This is an example of a binormal distribution, where a binormal distribution is a discrete probability distribution in which one, the experiment consists of n independent trials, two, each trial has two outcomes, success or failure, and three, the probability of success is little p, which remains constant for each trial. For a binormal distribution, the probability of having r successes is equal to n choose r times p raised to the power of r times the quantity one minus p raised to the power of n minus r. For our situation, p will represent the probability of survival And because a patient will die 60% of the time, little p, the probability of survival, is equal to one minus 60%, which is equal to 40%, or as a decimal, 0 0.4. And because we are selecting five patients, and the number of independent trials is five, and because we are trying to determine the probability that three patients will survive, R, the number of successes, is equal to three. And therefore, the probability that three of five survive is the probability that X is equal to three, which is equal to N choose R, which is five choose three, times P raised to the power of R, which is 0 0.4, the probability of survival, raised to the power of three, the number of successes, times the quantity one minus P, which is one minus 0 0.4, 0 0.6, which is the probability of death, raised to the power of n minus r, which in our case is five minus three, which is equal to two. Once we have this set up, notice how the sum of the exponents will always be equal to n. And now to evaluate this, five choose three is equal to five factorial divided by the product of r factorial and n minus r factorial, where r factorial is three factorial and n minus r factorial is two factorial. Now let's go ahead and evaluate this quotient. Five factorial is equal to five times four times three times two times one, which is three factorial. So let's write this as five times four times three factorial divided by the product of three factorial and two factorial. And then we have times 0 0.4 to the third times 0 0.6 squared. Simplifying here, three factorial divided by itself simplifies to one. Five times four is 20. Two factorial is two times one or two. 20 divided by two is equal to 10, giving us 10 times 0 0.4 to the third times 0 0.6 squared. And now we go to the calculator. 10 times 0 0.4 cubed times 0 0.6 squared is equal to 0 0.2304, which as a percentage is 23.04%. The probability that of five patients suffering from this disease, three will survive is 23.04%. I hope you found this helpful.